So my mantra is to so everything, there is a season and a purpose. And I think for me, I've incorporated it as a mother. Uh, I think that there are def different, you know, seasons in motherhood, the like baby season, then toddler, then now the season that I am in is um, preteen. Uh, and um also, the purpose behind it is always just to be a, a mom, but I feel like different stages of motherhood have different purposes. And so season purposes, that's my mantra. And um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> well, you, you've always been such a good, visible mom. What are some of the things that you love about being a mom? I think just spending time with my girls, I think that, uh, you know, teaching them how to be women, I think they're just really in these like formative years. And uh, it's just, I like, I, I think building memories is also very important for me. So spending time with them, you know, creating memories that they'll hopefully, you know, uh, share with their own children when they grow up, just traditions. And I think time is very important for me. So I try to spend as much time with my kids as much as I can. So yeah. what are some things you like to do together? Shopping. Uh, Shopping. Do we enjoy going for coffee dates. We like going out to eat at restaurants, traveling, uh, just and playing video games. I don't play. I just, I watch them play video games. <laughs> and so anything really, as long as I'm with them, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I love that. You know, I've known you since uh, you had babies and now you're going into the preteen years. And we talked a little bit about uh, hoping to start a blog about that. Um, what, yeah. what is a, some, what, what would be some advice that you would share with moms that you've learned along this wonderful parenting journey you've been on? I think transitioning to, uh, I have a middle schooler now, she goes to a different school and uh, you know, you know, being exposed to different kids uh, that are older uh, and that don't necessarily have the same mind frame as you, uh, I think is, is it, it, it can be challenging. My child is very reserved and, you know, she uh, she's just different and, you know, bullying is out there and you'd have to be able to cope with it as a mother, as a preteen. And it, it, it's, it's painful. It's hard to watch your child going through you know, just the you know teenage years or preteen years because it's a whole different ball game. Uh, so that's pretty much what I would really want to talk about. Just you know, give you the give moms or and dads too the tools to deal with bullying because oftentimes you know the schools don't do much about it. And so just helping my my children or you know children in general have uh the tools to uh you know fight back, not necessarily like physically, but just like fight back <laughs> you know what I mean and stand their ground you know and just know that they are just great the way they are regardless of what they say so yeah. that's something I didn't expect to encounter with my child you know and I didn't know what to do so I even thought of like homeschooling and then I you know came back to my senses because no I'm not ever going to do that but you know <laughs> that that was like that's just what I, I, I thought of doing just to alleviate the um the burden, you know, I just know that some women, some moms homeschool. I just don't know that it's for me, but you know, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry <laughs> she didn't like, go through that. That yeah, and that does I, it rips it rips your heart out. It does, it does. But she's better this year, I think. So the school she goes to is a middle school. It's five and sixth grade. So she came from like kindergarten to fourth grade, and five and six, and I think you know, the people that you're comfortable with from third, fourth grade are no longer with you. Some move and I know her best friend moves and it was just, it was a lot of adjusting and then, you know, there's like hormones and things like that. So, yeah. yeah, it's, yeah. that's hard. That's hard. Yeah. But that's definitely one of the topics that I would talk about. 